Disneyland. There's California Adventure. There's Disneyland. Here is us. Look at their monorail. It's possible tomorrow. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Sam, how does it feel? Like Bizarro World, a little. It's so weird, right? It's really cool though. Look at the train. I can't believe we made it. So Disneyland is different with Genie Plus. You have to be in the park to make your first lightning lane. So Sam is on it. We did wake up at 7 a.m. and get Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway though. Yeah, we got the virtual queue for that. Yeah. But now we can book our first lightning lane. I'm Woo! Thinking I'm thinking Matterhorn, yes! Oh wow, look how cute it is. Here you leave today and enter the world of yesterday, tomorrow, and fantasy. Mailbox. <laughs> oh yeah, we're gonna mail some postcards. Oh my gosh. It's like the same but different. I wanna go on that. out in his 100th anniversary outfit. All right. This is my personal best. <laughs> We're riding a Main Street vehicle. First first thing, first time. How cool is this? Uh -huh. We're gonna get a horseless carriage down Main Street. Ah! <laughs> it's like we're, we're a little parade. <laughs> so this is like, it's so interesting because it's like similar but so different and everything's just a little bit smaller. We're not gonna be worth your while. Look at the castle! Oh, yeah. ah! Sleeping Beauty's castle. Ooh, I can't believe it. <laughs> Is this like not the most in style way yeah, I to mean, do this? I don't think there's any better way. No. Oh. And here we are in Vault Original Park. <laughs> I have been so excited for Jolly Holiday. This is something we don't have at Walt Disney World. So this is the first thing we're gonna do. We need some coffee and some breakfast. It's so pretty in there, like beautiful details everywhere. They're playing Mary Poppins music and they have so many, so many good options. I got the Jolly Holiday Special, which is a delicious, delectable grilled cheese sandwich and tomato soup. And Sam got the strawberry croissant, which looks so good. Cheers. Mm. That is good. I feel a lot too. Yeah, that is good. Mm. Look at this. Oh yeah. Oh, that's the stuff. That is the stuff. While we've been sitting here eating, a marching band has gone by. So much has happened already to get us excited. And we have our first lightning lane really soon. Some of the things we're most excited for though are Mr. Toad and Snow White and things that we don't have at Disney World in Florida. The partner statue, Walt's original park, and the castle. And we'll get lots of views of this throughout our day. The Disneyland band, Mickey Mouse and friends for the happiest march along on earth. Come follow the band as we march from ah! City Castle to Town Square. Meet us at the castle for the happiest march along on earth beginning in just a few minutes. We just heard they're doing the happiest march along on earth, so we've got to we've got to line up to see it. I I'm gonna march. I think that's what we caught the end of when we first walked in when we saw Mickey like conducting. Uh -huh. So now we're gonna see it from the beginning coming out of the castle. Are we marching all the way back?
one. lightning lane of the day is the Matterhorn. That's a roller coaster here at Disneyland, something we do not have in Florida. Check out the monorail. Look at the, the cat, the Cheshire cat. I can like smell the ride water and it just, uh, I can hear people screaming, I can hear the wind. The Matterhorn opened here at Disneyland in 1959. There's two separate tracks that run which, which one do you think we'll get? Matterhorn bobsleds. There's the lightning lane entrance. The bobsled run is a high-speed, turbulent roller coaster type ride through Matterhorn Mountain that includes sharp turns and sudden drops and stops. Will this work? Oh, that's the wrong hand. It worked. Cool. And then people can slip their phone into here. That's neat. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Whoa. Number one, front row. Can't believe it. Yeti. That's not him. I feel the same. I feel the same. Here we go, Sam. Oh my gosh. We do have that in Hollywood Studios. They just opened their brand new one here at Disneyland, like just, what, like a week ago? Yeah, like two weeks ago or something like that? And we got a virtual queue for it, so we're gonna ride theirs. I got up at seven yeah. and got it, and then we just got called now at 12.15. Not bad. So, not bad, not bad. Yeah, yeah. The Small World facade. Like a small world. Oh my God. I am going bonkers looking at their Small World facade. It's so beautiful. We're definitely gonna ride this today, but we'll do that a little later. Also, their photo pass comes with Genie Plus, so we get all our photo pass pictures. The ride pictures are already like coming, I think free for everyone now, but we get like photo pass pics, we just took some. Mickey's Toontown is closed right now. It's undergoing some renovation, so, but we can get in. It's kind of cool that the virtual queue also lets us get in here to walk around because they're only letting people with one in. I like the sign. Oh my gosh, Toontown is so cute. We just have to come back now when it's once it's reopened. Do you remember when we had like Mickey and uh, Minnie's houses? At yes, I miss I that. that. I wish I could ride Roger yeah. Rabbit, but it's all closed. It's so cute though. I like these hills. I love the hills. This is so, so cute. Coming tune, Mickey's Toontown is getting a tune up. So they're gonna do a whole revamp here. Here's Disneyland's Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway. Already looks really different. They did choose a theater facade. They did. Uh, El Capitoon. What's cool too is we get to go through the standby so we'll get to see all the cute stuff. El Capitoon. They have movie posters all with Mickey and Minnie and you know, Disney cartoons. I can't even talk, I can't even think. Like coming in this room, the first thing I think of is old Hollywood studios. Absolutely. How cute are these posters? It was all started by a mouse. 
Mickey through the ears. <laughs> oh my gosh, wow. This is kind of cooler. Oh my gosh, look at the concession stand. <gasps> Goofy. The wrong door. It's like the popcorn noise and everything. Can you get me a chocolate chip and dow cookie? Uh, I'll have a giant pretzel, uh, a whole thing, whole thing, a whole thing. Have... What have you got? What have you got? Popcorn? I'll take the large. We'll take the lot. <laughs> Listen to the popcorn noises. I like that. Literally, I want everything. Oh my gosh. Those are those old school things. They have them in the park here still. Mallard cups. Is this? No. <laughs> was, that, was that you? Don't tell Mickey. <laughs> Your cheese, nacho cheese. This cute. It, it's, it's really, really good. It really like, makes you excited to get on. Yeah, and it makes it fun to wait in line. Look at that! This is so cool. Wow. Sorcerer Throne. Lonesome Ghost Dresser. If you stand long enough, you might see a beautiful reflection in the mirror. I saw it. Come back. <laughs> Hello? We just Ghost? beautiful anyway. <laughs> it was so fast! <gasps> The beanstalk! <laughs> you can hear it breaking through the ceiling. Look, Christmas! Are you ready to have a perfect picnic? There's one in every theater. Yeah. It must be a popular movie because it's shown in every screen. <laughs> theater lights blinking. Welcome in, moviegoers, to the world premiere of Picture Perfect. Hi, Goofy! Well, a beautiful day for a picnic. <laughs> 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 it feels cold. Yeah. Sounds like a lot of paperwork. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, look at that. I don't know. Since we're in here, a quick look around. I love it so much. I see some construction workers too working on it. Oh, and look over there. Construction. -y. Lots of scaffolding. Looks like Goofy's hat up there. Look, they're gonna have like a like a play area and they're working on their masterpiece. The giants over there. Yeah, because of, you know, first perspective, that top level is so tiny and the normal sized men look giant up there. Yeah, they're huge. That's right. Let's go in the post office. Let's see, what do we got to send here? 
Hey, what are you doing looking in my mailbox? I don't look in yours. Hey. Is there a love letter from Mickey in my mailbox? What's Goofy got? He's upside down. <laughs> Honey Bunny Roger sends the cutest letters. That's, a, that's not her voice. <laughs> Don't forget to see Gadget's go coaster. <laughs> cute. This is the cutest land. I look like a wheel. watch it. What do I look like in here? <laughs> oh, smash that train? Ready? Push it down. Didn't work. You're too nice to blow it up. Okay, let's go. You're in the dog pound. <laughs> so while we're just ooing and awing over every little detail in this land, it is so cute, so adorable, and, and so just nostalgic. We are Lightning Lane for Space Mountain came up, so we're gonna go ride Space Mountain, and then as it works kind of the same. As we tap in, we get the next lightning lane. But here at Disneyland, lightning lane doesn't work for every single ride, but it's also not needed because the lines are not long for a lot of the rides that we want to ride, like the fantasy land and stuff like that, but we will get to it. It is interesting how Genie Plus kind of like changes the order you would do things in, but it also cuts down your wait time so much that it's, you know. All right, so let's go ride Space Mountain Disneyland version. So I missed 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea so much, and the version here has been updated to Nemo, uh, but I've never done it. I've, I've never done it here at Disneyland. I've never done, I didn't do the original version Ooh. or this version. Oh my gosh. It looks crazy. Have... So we have to do it. I, yeah. I don't even like, I remember it very vividly. Get in that little hole? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know, but it looks awesome. I love 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea when it was at Disney World, and I'm just excited to see any version of it still alive and to get in a Nautilus. Look how it opens, you see over there? That's how you climb yeah. in. And I get, it's got like windows under the water. Yeah. And again, I've never done the Disneyland version, so I do not know what this version is like. And I've never watched any video on the Disneyland version no, either. either. So it'll be a total surprise for us. It's a very windy day at the Matterhorn. Yeah. <laughs> It's like, whoa. it's so neat to see the differences in the lands here. Their Tomorrowland is so different. This Tomorrowland is such a weird hodgepodge of stuff. It really is. I like it though. Like this, just the fonts, the signage, and the design reminds me of old school. Got the Pizza Planet rocket and Disneyland's Space Mountain, and that's what we're doing next. 30 minutes standby wait, so nice to have that lightning lane. So this is what I was talking about earlier. Disneyland announced that photo pass photos from rides are gonna be complimentary for everyone for the time being. So that's really cool. And then with our Genie Plus, we get complimentary or included photo pass for the photographers out in the park too. Look at how different this is, so cool. I'm always ready for space. Me too. Any version of space, we'll take it. High speed turbine roller coaster type ride in dark, getting blue, sharp turbulent, sudden drops, and then stop. B12. I'm so ready! Even looking at the trains. Yeah. Everything looks so retro here. The past version of what they thought the future would be. Which is now the past. Yeah. 
which I love that vibe. They saw me. We'll get there. I kind of like how it's two side by side rather than the bobsled like three in a row thing. Oh, I really like the music on this. Me too. that spot it's like oh, oh. we're gonna pop on the Nemo submarine voyage now got a cool view of the Matterhorn while we're in line here I still hit that wind let's go play basketball in there Finding Nemo Submarine Voyage is an underwater adventure experienced inside an enclosed semi-submerged vessel so you go down through a spiral staircase We've been waiting like 10 minutes so far, so maybe 10 more minutes. It's cool going to a park that we're not like going to all the time so that there's so much to Yeah, it's our first Disney Cruise of the year. <laughs> Good one. Seafarer. The water looks so beautiful. Go for a swim. We're going down. Wow. This is a tight little thing. Oh my gosh. Here we go. Wow. Here we go. Everybody gets their own window. In the submarine, we're going into the sea. It doesn't really close right now. Yet. <gasps> they closed it. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, you're just chilling out the top. Stand by to dive. Lightning Lane next for Autopia. It already looks so different. There's the Disneyland Railroad. We hopefully we get to ride that today too. Love the train here. Bam. Look at that behind a robot again. California dream. Because it's like more close. Look at the monorail. Whoa. Whoa. We have a crazy driver yeah. up ahead. Yeah. Even though it's not a real car and I know we're on a track, yeah. every time he swerves towards us. Yeah. Whoa. Whoa. Oh god. This looks like what everyone told me to expect driving in LA. Look at the license plate in this car in front of us. Toad. It's a sign. Foreshadowing. It's an omen. Ooh. Nice drive. <laughs> It's churro time. Churros. Churros. They're not my cinnamon. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Disney churros are better. Mm -hmm. I think they are. They're might right. Be. They might be. It's warmer. It's fresher. There's more like a cinnamon taste. And um, 
Yeah, it's really, really nice. So we can go take this into the line with us. Mine won't make it. Yeah. <laughs> Mr. Toad's Wild Ride. This used to be a ride at Magic Kingdom in Disney World. They sadly and sillily, in my opinion, got rid of it. And it is one of the things I've been most excited to ride here at Disneyland. And we are just seeing the outside of it. We saw the got a line churro. That's the way to do it. They're playing When You Wish Upon a Star. Take a wild joy ride in a motor car careening through the noisy nighttime streets of London to nowhere in particular. There he is, there's Mr. Toad. I love the flowers too. Almost going in. I am just filled with happiness right now. I love this facade. I love everything. Whoop. Mr. Toad, thank you for inviting us to your home. What a lovely gentleman. Toad Paul. Look at how beautiful. I believe that building is fetching a now. It's just dripping with charm. Oh, did you see that? Woo! <laughs> you got sparkling in there. We're getting ratty. I think we're getting. Oh no, you're right. Oh yeah, we're getting ratty. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Off we go! Ooh! Oh! Whoa! Whoa! Uh-oh! It's fast! Yeah. Oh my gosh. I love it. <laughs> well, we'll have to remedy River that. Road, River Road to London. Uh oh, uh oh. Whoa! Whoa! Ah! Oh, my eyes. Oh, we're at the park. Yeah! Fantasyland, or just like in the cat in the medieval town behind the castle. Once upon a time, a kind and lovely princess named Snow White had a wish, but her wish was not meant to be. For the cruel queen, envious of her beauty, commanded she be a humble maid. Don't worry, though. In the long run, her wish does come true. It's not scary anymore. Well, I'm gonna pretend that it's still scary. In my heart, it's always Snow White scary. I miss it from Magic Kingdom. Banished to a dim chamber for her bedroom, Snow White grew still lovelier each day. <gasps> Look at this. <laughs> the seven dwarfs are inside their cottage. And we're gonna go in to see them. They're dancing, there's Snow White. Cute, thank you. Here we go. Thank 
Fantasyland is getting really crowded and the lines are getting long in there. So we're gonna make our way over to somewhere else and do some more rides over there. And hopefully the rest of the rides in Fantasyland will have shorter waits later. We'll see, we'll see if that works out. Either way, keep going. So we are gonna go through this entrance into the Galaxy's Edge here and just kind of walk through it. It's so different, right? Yeah. I remember coming in here on the opening day of this land. That was cool. That was cool. That was a cool day. There you go. Yeah, it's cool to hear the sounds change. I like this. This is neat. Yeah, me too. And here we are in Batu West. <laughs> right away. The Millennium Falcon. Immediately one difference, there isn't a humongous line for Doc Ondars. He's hard at work on both coasts. <laughs> oh my god! It's the baby! He's beautiful. You do a wonderful, honorful job of taking care of him. Thank you for what you do. We are humongous. You're, you're known across the galaxies. That's correct. On the other side. You know the best way to cook a spider's egg? How? With a flamethrower. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye, then. Goodbye. Oh my god! You told me a joke. That was amazing. That was really cool. We don't have that. No, we do not have that. Oh man. Well, you know you're very confident when you haven't thought this through. Thanks for the visit. That was so, so cool, and I hope that Mando can make his way to Batu East. The reason they don't, I don't think, is because of the Star Cruiser. And those people, like, if they come down to see, like, Mandalorian, they'll be like, huh? Oh, just, yeah, the Galaxy's Edge here uh, isn't doesn't have to be as strict on the timeline as uh, at Walt Disney World. Splash Mountain here at Disneyland is still open. They haven't closed it yet, but they will be getting Tiana's Bayou Adventure, just like, just like at Walt Disney World. What you see before you is Disneyland's Haunted Mansion. It fits more into the New Orleans Square theme. It's a very different facade than the Walt Disney World Haunted Mansion, and we are gonna do that next. It's so different with the wrought iron and the white and green and the pillars. It's oh my more gosh. Gosh. It definitely is. The pet cemetery is just right out front like this. Here lies my snake whose fatal mistake was frightening the garter who carried a rake. Thankfully we grabbed a lightning lane for this one. I can't hear <gasps> I'm so not used to how close you get to the house in this one. It's the front door. <laughs> We're going in. You don't really hear the music. 
music outside here. Maybe it was just too loud, I'm not sure. The stretching room here is actually an elevator, unlike at Walt Disney World. Is this haunted room actually stretching? It is here. Or is it your imagination? Mm -hmm. And consider this dismaying observation. This chamber has no windows and no doors. <laughs> Which offers you this chilling challenge to find a way out. <laughs> That was so cool. We actually went down in the elevator. So different. But there's room for a thousand. Any volunteer? So in the queue here, they have the portraits that flash, they have the lightning and thunder out the windows, and they have the marble busts like up ahead. It's, it's like these little differences that are so neat. The old thrifts all over the world. Any volunteers? <laughs> if you insist on lagging behind, by the hand, please. And kindly watch your step. Oh yes, and no flash pictures, please. We spirits are frightfully sensitive. Mardi Gras month, but this is here all year long. New Orleans Square is home to Pirates of the Caribbean and their tree is under massive construction right now. Welcome to Adventureland Treehouse. So this is the concept art. This is my first time actually getting to meet you, which is super cool. It's just business over there. You're not running the auction. You know, there's lots of pirates. You've got to make sure they stay in line. Of Understandable, of course. Well, it's wonderful to meet you. Sadly, Indiana Jones Adventure is down for some kind of construction refurbishment. It says coming soon, temple tours will begin again this spring. And so that means we can't ride that today. So it just means we'll have to come back to make sure we can ride it because I love this ride. Uh, yeah, we'll be back. It's Esmeralda. Gotta say hi to her when you're here. It's kind of hard to see because the reflection. There we go. Hi, Esmeralda. 
All right, it is about that time. It's dinner time, we're hungry. So we're gonna try the Red Rose Tavern here in Fantasyland. Yeah, it looks fine, it looks cozy in there. Ooh, cozy, look, it's Be Our Guest themed. Bonjour. My dogs are barking. <laughs> it's nice to sit down and just take a load off and have some food. I just kept it simple and ordered a flatbread and some chicken tenders and a cordon bleu sandwich between us and we're gonna enjoy that and then we'll get back out to the park and keep on going but it is cozy in here and we've got Gaston to keep us company so you know. He's right there. Did you know apparently hush puppies, the shoes, uh -huh. are called that after the saying like dogs are barking. Really? Like hush the puppies? I mean that's what Google tells me. So. All right, so we just went for some quick service because we do have a few big eating days coming up, but you know we had to do it right. I got the strawberry tea. That's like a specialty here. Mmm, mmm, that's really nice. Strawberry tea. Oh, we gotta try this, Sam. It's really good. Mmm. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I got us a couple more, we really like them. All right, that was satisfying and good. We're satiated, we're ready to go back out into the park. And it looks like while we were sitting in here dining and relaxing and letting our feet rest, it looks like it's turned to nighttime. Like, I think it's dark out. Let's find out. Not only is it night, but it's gotten chillier. Ooh. Something I've been wanting to do all day is ride the storybook boats, go into Monstro's mouth, come out the other side, Whoa. Yeah, it's gotten chilly, right? It's a chilly out here. Eh? Yeah, that's California for you. It's like, yeah. it can be a little bit warm in the day, and then at night, Ooh, brisk. Storybook land canal boat. It does look so pretty and magical at night. Exit out to your left. We're on. We're on. Look, ducks. travel too far off places by turning the of Disney stories and it was really cute and charming. I definitely would like to come back and do that during the day, but you know, yeah, I'm glad we did it. All right, we're back in Fantasyland. The lines are a bit shorter, so we're gonna do Pinocchio's Daring Journey now. Puppet Theater. good dark ride should do an absolute favorite and cannot miss we have a lightning lane for big thunder mountain railroad 
I can hear people enjoying it from here. I like this little area. Look how beautiful the riverboat is. Mark Twain. Yeah, it's gorgeous. Nighttime. Look at how cool the saloon is. But it felt so much faster. Yeah, it's quite wild. Yeah, it really was the wildest ride in the wilderness. <laughs> and of course, we have to ride Pirates of the Caribbean. It's a slightly different version here. It's a little bit longer, and I think theirs is a bit cooler. <laughs> It's just right there. There it is. So funny. <laughs> We've been going hard. I love how you can see like parts of the ride yeah. from the queue up. Yeah. There's a blue bayou. Yeah, we wanted to eat there. The reservation was booked, 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 and we kind of booked this last minute, so maybe next time we can try to dine there. We went and asked, but it was like just. <laughs> I love this part. waiting to get in it's so cool it's definitely a longer ride here than it is in Disney World and there's extra scenes and it just feels bigger and more cavernous and kind of cooler the animatronics look really old-school and cool Walt himself had a hand in this and so many iconic Imagineers and it's just very very classic Disney boat ride dark ride awesome ride and I will tell you one more thing about the pirates right here. My derriere sucked. <laughs> you are soaked and I'm not. Yeah, uh, there are two drops and it's really cool, but it just, the water just, I don't know how, but I'm just. It just got under. Yeah. <laughs> nice and chilly to keep it nice and cold. Ooh. New Orleans Square looks cool at night. It's all lit up. Welcome to our tropical hideaway. You lovely people, you. I'm just here for Rosita. It's a small world, New York World's Fair. The facade is beautiful, can't be beat. 
So they've got a brand new It's a Small World and Kanto projection going on, so we will stay to watch it. Ooh, ooh, look. today and it's getting close to the end of the day and there is a nighttime projection show they don't do fireworks on weekdays only on weekends but last night we saw the fireworks from our hotel so I'll like inject those into the end of the video somewhere but we are gonna watch the wondrous projection show we have to ride the train first right yeah, we have to so let's let's hop aboard choo choo hop aboard Oh, chilly and we're on. You face forward on this train so you're looking into the park. It's kind of cool. We get a as we know it today but it wasn't always this way now let's travel back in time way back in time to the fantastic past of the primeval world land of the dinosaurs At this point, um, it's a little bit less than an hour until the nighttime show, so we're gonna do a little shopping on Main Street and then watch the show to close out the evening. I really like how the Main Street vehicles here run day and night. And the Disneyland Fire Department with the lamp on on the second floor. <laughs> we found a spot, we can see the castle. There's gonna be projections on Main Street too, but it was kind of a choice of like seeing Main Street or seeing the castle, so we have a castle view. We can look back there and see Main Street too, but the main projection show is going to be on the castle. So we're excited to watch it. We'll just hang out, hold down the spot. A lot of folks are sitting down, so we're sitting too. And we went to show. We've been... We went R today, yeah. 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 yeah, and this will be like the closing thing. And then we still have to walk back to the hotel after this. It's really close. It's a close walk, but like it's still... Now we're just gonna chill. Yeah, and watch the show, yeah. For over a hundred years, Walt Disney Animation Studios has invited audiences to believe in things never thought possible. And so tonight, we once again invite you to wish upon stars, to step into the unknown, and to join us on this our wondrous journey. Some things start out big, and some things start out small. But sometimes the smallest thing can make the biggest changes of all. Hard to know. Just where it starts, how it grows From just a spot It's wondrous I feel it now, it's you and me A gentle stream of 
one will think what comes next will be wondrous. the monorail. My service to Thank you. It's a very different seating arrangement. You can sit facing either window or like inside. Either. And the window's open, which is weird. All right, downtown Disney. I'm not really dancing, my feet just hurt. <laughs> Same, I'm, I'm like hobbling. We've made it out of the park and it was a magical, fantastic, wonderful, I'd even say wondrous day at Disneyland. Our first time here together, only my third time here at this park ever and probably the most time I've actually spent in the park and definitely doing the most Things. We made the most of the day. We did so much and we've got another day tomorrow at Disney's California Adventure And that is gonna be my first time in that park. So I am so Excited we loved the show. We loved the rides. We loved everything we did. We're <laughs> Exhausted but in the best possible way like our feet hurt and we're tired but like in the way of that feeling of like we did so much of course there's still so much more to do but that also means there's more to come so stay tuned because more exciting videos coming up travel and fun things and all the things thank you so much for hanging out with us today i hope you had just you felt the the magic and the happiness through the screen you know we're florida locals so coming out here it's like a whole new world for us and it's really well a whole new land and it's, it's really great to be here at Walt's original park and just feel all the magic and wonderfulness. And yeah, it just ah, thank you again for hanging out with us. I am sending you all a ton of love. I'll see you for the next video, which should hopefully be coming out soon, of the next part of this wondrous journey. <laughs> and until then, as always, stay enthused. Bye.